Hi guys, um, it's me Miss Major. What's up? Um, I just speed up this video because I didn't want to um, do a lot of editing due to the fact that I kind of just want to show off this uh, area right here and um, you know get some things done and get it done quicker. Um, yeah, just, as I tell you, and I had to show it off. And when I was editing, I was looking through, and I was like. Oh my gosh, so hopefully, fingers crossed, today's the day, I don't want, don't want to give it a spoiler, you know, so, you know, but, um, I don't sure if this spray paint is healthy for her most of this child, I don't know, because she just inhaled some, so, they got me really scared, really fast, you know, so I was going to get a drink or something like that, and just try to get her mind off some things, you know, so, um, that would be awesome. <laughs> And hopefully she doesn't have a dizzy here, because, like, I'll be really freaking out, you know. But, um, I did notice that that's that little bubble, um, oh no, what, what's it called? I forgot what it's, called, what it's called, but, like, you can, like, do different bubbles and stuff, so. I think that was, like, a really cute moment, and the way it sounded was, like, really cute and really adorable. Plus, the seats are really good for her, so, like, awesome, <laughs> that's fantastic, you know. But she did uh, meet a friend, and they're meeting up right now, and, um, I basically had, like, this long discussion, this long talk with her, because I just wanted to, you know, make sure that she was making a part of friends. So, um, I wasn't too keen on having a daylight, and I think I was trying to make her find a bathroom or something like that, and I couldn't find one. So I was like, okay, let's go to the library, you know, and, uh, let's do some research, because I want her to lower up her, um, vampire skills as much as possible before the baby even comes, you know? So we're at the library now, she's like so huge, so we're just gonna do some, uh, um, reading, I guess, <laughs> and get some stuff done, you know? So we're just gonna go ahead and do that, and just tell her have some fun, you know? I, um, I really look forward to her having her try out, hopefully, in this episode. I don't know, guys, you're to come here and look, you know? Um, I know that it's gonna be a longer episode, episode so we might get changed to a vampire or so. Oh, but so, so that's the first time since my who had um is she she burning? We should gonna watch this woman burn if she's gonna turn to flames. If not, then um I'm not sure how long it takes him to, to burst to flames. It's uh kind of confusing to me to be honest. But um if she is she gonna do it or not? She will. It's kind of confusing to me. Is she? Is it my thing freeze? Probably the whole go away. So, um, yeah, we're just trying to, um, just get up her points as much as we can so that way we can, like, level up in her skills. Um, because I'll be thanks, train. <laughs> you know? <laughs> So, uh, the, the, those, like, the one that we got set for is like a thousand, but we did get caught stealing, so, you know, um, he stole our book too, so, that's bad, that's fine, even though it was like our book to begin with. Um, so yeah, it's just a bit embarrassing. <laughs> I thought everybody was at the library, but apparently not, so, yeah, whatever. Um, I'm not sure really what's gonna happen in this episode, but hopefully she gets her book done, reading, and whatnot. And, have her level up, but can you like suck on Twitter and like put plasma in this episode? I mean, in this server because that'd be freaking awesome, you know what I mean? Like, very, 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 very awesome. Um, but I don't think you can because I don't know, but um, yeah, I'm not sure really what I'm doing. <laughs> I'm clicking everything randomly on the screen, it doesn't make any sense whatsoever, but uh, yeah. <laughs> I'm trying to move up her points, but, um, yeah, I'm not really sure what to pick and what not to pick, to be honest, so, yeah, um, yeah, okay, that's great, uh, so, yeah, that's gonna be a hard one to do, especially with her being pregnant right now, but, uh, yeah, I'm just, um, totally looking forward to her pregnancy and whatnot. And I did kind of slow this down. Well, well, I slowed it down. It's not fast for y'all. Like, I'm not using the buttons or anything. But, um, I don't know what to really do. Wait, oh my gosh. Are you serious? Are you serious? I don't think I even noticed that. Like, 
Yeah, I think I was more focused on buying book than anything, but I don't think I noticed that, that she was pregnant until, like, it was too late, and I was like, what's going on? What's going on? What is I think I was freaking out. I'm not gonna lie. I think I was freaking out. So I want to have the baby at the hospital because, well, not, we're probably gonna get the baby daddy in here. So that way he can, uh, well, ex, well, not ex baby daddy, but he's gonna be there for her because we're not like her. Well, you know what I mean. So, of course, he's gonna freak out, and I'm just kind of like, eh, what to do? You know, so, um, I'm not 100% sure what to do. I guess we're gonna go ahead and check in, I'm guessing, or what? I think this is a very exciting moment, so. Yeah, I was really surprised, and yes, I did know that she's gonna have a baby in this episode. That's why I was trying to cut everything and make everything soupy speak, because I, I wanted everything in one episode. So I was trying to cut out a lot of things as I can, and speed up a lot of things as I can. Even though I did want to focus on the, um, uh, the new Talon City, sorry, I forget names so fast, so much. But, um, yeah, I, uh, um, honestly... I'm very excited to have this child, and um, do I have to check in again? Not. I'm not very sure if I have to. But, um, yeah, I, um, we're just gonna stand here, I guess. It's just very awkward. Do I go somewhere? We were at the hospital. So, we had to wait on the doctor and wait on this guy. I, it's kind of going slow. Very slow. Like, what do I do? Okay, she disappeared. Do not know what. Okay, what is this machine? Uh, what? What's going? Okay, they said the her daughter coming over here or something. And she doesn't want to get married. That's fine. She needs to feed, so that's fantastic. Uh, uh, okay, I guess we're going to. Okay. See, I never had a baby at the hospital, so I don't know what to expect. It's amazing. Is that a heart? Or is that a tomato? That's a heart. Then it, it's a girl. Um, I guess um, I don't know what they were really. I don't. <laughs> guess we can. Uh, I don't know. But uh, for y'all, if you guys want to make babies in future episodes, or what if I make a nurse sim? If you guys want to do names. Please leave them in the comments down below because that will be fantastic and I totally will use your name suggestions because I'm not good with names so um, I looked up the name Morticia and make sure make sure I spell that right because that would be embarrassing because like you know it's a girl so why not and I love Adam's family so what yeah look you gotta go ahead and do that just give her the R for that and sorry if I'm moving around a lot and you guys hear it, I um, hurt my knee the other day and don't know how. So that's fine. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, I'm excited that uh, we had a child. And um, that child is so awesome and bald. <laughs> you know, this is an awesome moment that we're having here at the hospital. And, um, yeah, I'm, I'm all lost for words. I'm pretty happy. That this um, child, okay, she disappeared, and we're turning into her maybe regular clothes. I'm not sure if we go home on our own, but I'm just gonna go ahead and feed on this woman right here because we uh, need to drink <laughs> badly. So hopefully, we can get her in before anything else happens, you know? So just okay, awesome. I guess we're gonna go where our baby is gonna go, but. I am so freaking excited, y'all, that this is happening, and, um, like I said, I'm not very good with toddlers. Me and toddlers don't get along, you know, like, in the same. In real life, I'm great with toddlers. I love kids, you know. 
gave it to the kids for my life and everything and um, was gonna do that for a profession profession and um, I'm not sure if I use that word right or I should say career wise I was gonna do that but got burned out <laughs> so I've been babysitting since I was like a teenager and I was like oh I'm, I'm done with that so we're here at our home and it was very very excited um right here I think I'm gonna possibly pause it I think yeah so um no we're not gonna pause it <laughs> so um sorry about that I um shoot so we're gonna go ahead and feast on someone right now because um we need to to be honest so I kind of messed myself up because I was talking and um that's, I don't know what's going on with screen. <laughs> okay, yes, I'm back with the yeah, screen now. Um, I was clicking because I wanted to see uh, what, what was happening, but of course my dumb self had to just go ahead and click off screen. So uh, while the baby is asleep, we're just gonna go ahead and um, try to feast on uh, a packet right now. Uh, try to get that uh, blood up and pumping. I keep saying blood, but it's plasma, but I'm not sure why we can't um, do the blood thing because uh, I think it'll be awesome. I'm not gonna lie. So we're just gonna go ahead and feed some a few sims and stuff. So I may cut out a lot of this out because I do want to go ahead and um, just focus on the child now. You know, I don't want to go too far away from the house because to me that wouldn't make any sense or whatsoever. You know, I don't want to go too far and mess myself up. You know, or have my child get taken away. But don't you guys love this outfit? I think this outfit is amazing. You know what I mean? I think it's like super duper amazing. So um, I'm glad that she's like very happy right now because like once that baby just a toddler, it's gonna be a lot of work. Um, if you guys want to also want me to continue onto my toddler series where I just focus basically on the toddlers and nobody else really, um, maybe not the time to jump in because um, I, I just want to like make sure I didn't do anything and then you thought I wanted to watch it, you know, or whatever, so let me know in the comments down below. And also if you guys want to do any challenges as well, because I was, we want to get back to the 100 baby challenge and I want to do the le legacy challenge and all that ch all that jazz. But I'm going to probably change the bathroom and move it over to where the tub is at because we need to get that up and running. But Due to our finances in The Sims, um, it's gonna be tough to really just decorate the way I want it to be decorated and still have money for bills and food. But that's just gonna be like real life, you know. But I think I forgot how to rotate things, you know. So uh, give me a moment, cause I'm uh, I'm close to be late doing this. Oh, okay, I remembered how. <laughs> Thank the Lord, I did. <laughs> Well, um, yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead and give her some rest, some much needed, oh, no, no, oh, she will wake back up, <laughs> and, uh, I think we have to probably, uh, shush, uh, <laughs> just try to quiet her down so that she's not, like, crying a lot, because, you know, you don't want to shed to be as, be as possible, so we're probably just going to just press feed. But so hopefully, this is a vampire child because I do not want to turn my own child into a vampire because I will not have guts to do it, you know. So I don't know really if she is or not. I'm not sure she's act like a regular child until she grows up. But if she's a taller and she's a vampire, like she can use her, she can use her. Um, as a child, that would be amazing. I think that Sims 4 should let us, like, if we do have a vampire child, we should, like, you know, let, let the child go through its vampire ways. Like, of course, the baby's gonna be a baby, but we want to just, like, go to its baby stage and it starts doing things, stuff like that. Yeah, I think that would be awesome because, you know, I don't know. I think that's just my opinion, but what do you guys think? I think that would be great, but I don't want to hire a nanny because I'm 
educated woman, and I want to, I got it going on. <laughs> I don't know. I'm going to speed up this right here because why not? But I'm thinking about um, trying to shoot really get the knot in and <laughs> not up blood words. So I'm just trying to, I don't feel bad about being a baby daddy and breaking up with him. So I think that we're going to go ahead and we have a relationship with him because why not you know uh, i've been listening to this for a few but a lot of people were like uh over caleb or liking caleb so i was just like mm, maybe i should just make it right because like uh i see people who have babies with him it's like this guy makes a lot of people babies so i was like mm, maybe i should make me or not but um i'm gonna try and get up my points and for the futurity potion and the sims 4 game so that way um i can i guess is uh, have like multiple babies at once, you know, so I think that'd be a, a great time to do. But I'm thinking like this is where the bathroom's at right now. I'm gonna move it to where the tub's at, so that way the baby, once the baby is grown up, uh, she can have her own room. Cause like right now, it doesn't make any sense to have her own room because she's in a bassinet, and I was like, you're that's your room right there, you <laughs> know. So I feel like she's going to touch those front again, so we're going to go ahead and uh, uh, quiet her down before we do anything. I think she needs a feeding, in my assumption. But, um, I'm not sure why all the Sims 4 babies are bald. That doesn't make any sense to me, because, like, I think when I was born, I had hair. I think I did. But, <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I just, um, I don't know. I just wish that I had, like, more variety in baby hair, in my opinion. Unless it's like not possible or hard, but um, yeah, I think it's just doing a great job right now. I just wish that um, for the vanilla version of Sims 4, that we didn't need to have to buy things to make it more interesting, you know? So, like, I shouldn't have to buy the cake and then, like, turn around and buy the icing at the more expensive price. That's just my opinion. Especially, like, I bought the um, the one that had like the animal hats and everything, I felt like there should have been more in that, to be honest. But yeah, I don't know. I I, I don't. I'm not trying to say like our um the Sims Four is dying, but um, there's just like a lot of things happening that I'm not really too happy or too fond with right now. So I don't know. It's just I just wish that um. Things were a little bit better, better, but I did hear that Sims 4 is going to be the last Sims 4 um, series. So, I think that's why they're playing a lot, a lot of free packs and whatnot. But hopefully we have a Sims 5, because that would be awesome. But uh, the rumors and everything that I heard of, um, you know, we may not have a Sims 5 or more Sims games to really enjoy other than 1, 2, and 3, and of course all the other uh, ones like busting out or herbs, you know, but hopefully we do, to be honest, because I, I, I will hate to have a game that I love playing as a child to end so suddenly, because, you know, I don't know, I'll, I'll be super duper upset, I'm not gonna lie, like, I'm choking up right now, I'm just thinking about it, so, uh, I don't know, but we're just gonna try things with, uh, Caleb and this, you know, <sighs> just see how things work out, and we're probably just going to marry and propose him to have an awesome little bit for our family, because why not? And um, I may change this outfit, I may not change it, it just really depends on um, my mood at the moment. And I do apologize for this, this being a longer series than normal, um, I just really want to just um, get things out there, and you know, uh, I guess, just, um, <laughs> you know, because uh, we have a lot of things happening this series, I mean, yeah, for this episode, sorry, and I just really wanted to get it out there and show you guys all the things that I do on a normal basis, so, um, yeah, that's just really what I wanted to do, I'm not gonna lie, and if I just want to um, not cut out all the other Doctor series, um, just because somebody wanted to watch it, but I did want to speed it up. Because, um, like I said, I was having issues with my laptop, but I am going to upgrade 
and um, get an actual gaming desktop so that way I can use my laptop for like chilling stuff and then use my PC for streaming and recording and, and uh, projects that I'm going to be working on so that way it's not going to be a total you know hassle on my laptop and I could buy a gaming, P gaming laptop but I really 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 desire to buy a desktop computer because um, that was my goal for like years and every time I try to set up for something for that something always happens so yeah I don't know I really really want that PC and I feel like I've been saying it for years now I've been saying it for a year on and I need to keep to my word and just do what I need to do but uh, yeah I just hate how like when my sim hisses people just go oh my god she's hissing but um that's the end of the episode Thank you everyone for watching and being part of the series so far. If you guys want more, uh, conversations and comments are always important to keep a series alive or not on the channel. Because like, if I do a series and people are not going to like it, why continue it? So if you guys want to continue it, please leave me in the comments down below. Please like it, share it, share with others who are also interested in Sims 4. And um, my name is Melissa Rico. And I'll see you guys later in the episode. See you guys later. Bye.